How's it going, lads? Marshall here, and welcome to yet another Harry Kane player review. This guy, he's just all over the place this year. He's just all over the place, and this card is the best card that you can purchase of Harry Kane on this game. A 79 rated gold in form, and he started at a 68 rated silver. That's just crazy. 75k minimum then, 150k maximum. If you want any cheap MSP, PSN, or game codes, head over to g2a.com, use the code N. M89 to get yourself a discount. Every link that you will need is in the description below. Now, in terms of mental and physical tributes, 85 attack and positioning, 82 vision and 82 stamina. His strength is good. His sprint speed is good at 79. The one downside was his acceleration. Skill attributes, 82 ball control, 83 finishing, 82 head and accuracy, 85 long shots. And just look at that. 89 shot power so this guy from distance has an absolute corker on him honestly his shot power is ridiculous free star weak foot free star skill moves and medium to medium work rates and i've got to say that free star weak foot it doesn't feel like a free star weak foot it feels like a five star because he can do stuff like this lads every single game just look at that strike from harry kane right into the back of the net in off the post thank you very much a crack and strike there from Harry Kane and he can do that like I said game after game time after time because his strikes are just golden every single time he can do it on his right peg as well this one from roughly the same distance over the top of the goalkeeper and into the back of the net a crack and strike once again from Harry Kane so in terms of pros long shots has to be one because his long shots are great finishing wise he is very clinical yes he can maybe score Three out of five chances or something like that. But he is very clinical for, an, uh, what was he, a 79 rated overall. That is very clinical for a striker of a 79 rated overall. And he can score goal after goal, game after game. Because this card, like I said earlier on in this episode, is the best Harry Kane card on the market that you can purchase. Unfortunately, you will be stuck with him because at 75k, I don't believe that he does sell. I'm stuck with him at the moment in time. I'm stuck with Ibrahimovic. These bloody price ranges are killing me. But um, anyways, let's about me more about you and what you can get with this card ball control sensational his long shots are great his movement is pivotal because if he's not making the runs beyond the last defender he's not getting the position to score the goals he's doing that every time lads and he's just great at doing that yes he lacks acceleration but his sprint speed is good in general once he does accelerate up to that top speed it does take him a while though and his dribbling is a con as well but overall his hold up play is great I mean he's quite tall he's not the tallest in the world but he's quite tall He's quite strong, he can bring others into play, and that's what I like about this card. So overall, he does get a 7.9 rating. Guys, I hope you have enjoyed this review. If you have, smash that thumbs up button, subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And as always, I keep saying it, I will catch you all next time.